Okay. This little work based project we've been working on from 2E0 VOV. Um, we're looking at a 2 meter and uh, 77 centimeters portable handheld telescopic antenna, which is basically a half wave dipole. Um, used a bit of 20mm conduit for the actual shaft of the handle with a uh, coupler on the end. Set some brass screws inside it, sorry, brass thread nuts in there. And they're held in with uh, a bit of resin or aerodite, whatever you want to recognize it as. 20mm uh, plug in the end. All sat in with resin about up to about there. And then the conduit itself is welded in with proper conduit sealant. Um, got our little choke here, one one choke, just wound round. Um, my soft handle, so we hold it like that. Bit of coax on the end with the BNC for the uh, radio. Simple parts of that, just a couple of clips in there. There we go, we're on here. SWR is looking lovely, I'll show you more of that later. Um, but basically, we've um, been on eBay. The only thing I actually had to buy um, outright was the telescopic whips, which came for just under three pound a pair. They live in the handle. So basically, we've got the two telescopic whips. Um, they're actually fifty-one centimeters. You don't need that. You only need about probably forty-nine and a half. But this was close enough. So there we go. Pull out telescopic whip, antenna one. Screw it in. Into there, one half your dipole, and then obviously the same for this side. When you're in the field, you obviously not come back to the set measurement. But this is just a demonstration for you. There we go, one dipole. Um, there you are. So basically, a halfway dipole for VHF, um, completely resonant, 50 ohms. Um, and it sings. So if anybody's looking for ideas, a fairly straightforward project takes about start to finish about an hour and a half to make. The um, most the only tricky part is actually getting the connections set up inside here, inside the junction box itself. Um, which uh, I soldered lugs on the back of the brass inserts, the nuts, um, to give them a decent purchase and to get good electrical connection. And then from then on, there's nothing that can possibly go wrong. Now it's all bonded and resin. It's watertight. You can go anywhere you want with it. And obviously when you're finished with it, you just take it apart and put it in your pocket. Um, there we go. One there. So that's what I'm doing at the moment. That's another project done. 